welcome and welcome back to all that the wind has brought here to another episode of Roots of Pacha where we are working on getting an upgrade to our watering can and we just discovered horses and captured our first chicken or tamed our first chicken I should say uh, apparently we got to spawn on shadow this morning so that's cool. Our crops are coming along quite well, which is exciting. We are working on improving our friendship with our animals. We are trying to get our Ibex fully leveled up. Uh, are you milkable? You are. Fantastic. A little bit of Ibex milk there. Which will dry into some cheese. Just to double check. I didn't see any shaggy boars. No. Okay. Always gotta check these things, right? And there are other male Ibex. And of course, not sage. Okay, so we'll run up to the processors, we'll pickle an egg, because why wouldn't we pickle an egg, right? Um, well, maybe we won't pickle an egg just yet. We'll have to wait on pickle any, pickling any eggs, but we are getting there. We are going to need more fruit, though. I don't see any more fruit here, so we are going to have to work on that, but that's okay. As far as everything goes here, we do not have enough wool just yet. That is okay. I'm going to throw some stone in here. We have a lot of stone, actually. And we're going to run over to the fields. And then if everyone here will pardon me for a moment, we're going to get these handled. I just want to take a second and let everybody know uh, about 10% of viewers are actually subscribed to this channel. So please click that link. Okay, and we are back. And we're up to level three beet knowledge. Uh, broccoli, we finally harvested one. Uh, kohlrabi is up to level 3. Lettuce, we have not harvested still. Um, in fact, we need to put lettuce up here. I don't even think we're growing that at the moment, so we're going to have to deal with that. But yeah, we are doing quite well. Uh, let's actually get some lettuce into the ground here, because we did harvest some things. Oh, oh, do we have just enough? I thought we had more. Hmm. Maybe I am mistaken. It appears as though I am. We're going to need to get this lettuce grown soon. And we will do that as soon as we can. However, we need to look at who we need to run into today. Um, Garrick we could talk to. He is almost done as well. But it looks like we've given most of our gifts to the people we want to give gifts to here. Uh, Croc we need to visit with and give strawberries to. We want to do that as soon as possible. And he is here today on the beach. And Took, if he's here, we want to give a piece of cheese to. And he is in the savannah. So that's looking great. We want to run up here and see what we can make happen. We do have a fermented butternut squash, but that is it. Um, and then, of course, we do also need to look under Pachins for Vuok, who is in the forest. All right. So let's go talk to Vuok and go and check the Ibex. And then we'll run off to the jungle. I think. 
Yeah. Because Zachary's still working on stuff for us, so that's okay. We should be able to get another chicken going today. And we may work on getting a horse as well. So I think I would like to do that. Okay. It's never about perfection. It's about striving to be better. Well, let's, one, upgrade our gazelle anklet. Yes, please. Silver gazelle anklet, a powerful accessory. I'll ask Popcha to bless this with her power. It should be ready in a few days. So we'll dance with you. And we'll check and see if he actually took our anklet or not. He did, okay. So, um, our earring of the will, we will have to switch out. Um, let's do the cave lioness one for right now. Okay. So we have more stamina than ever before. And running up this way. Uh, I don't see any new boar. Though perhaps we should check. That's a brown boar. So what boars have we discovered? That's going to be important to us. Boars. We have discovered brown, chocolate, camouflage, raspberry, gray, white, and black. Okay. That's gray. So I don't think there's anything new here. Okay. That's okay. Ibex. We are looking for the white Ibex. There's our Ibex. But no white one. A little bit more broccoli. That's okay. Okay. Let's go to the jungle and make friends with chickens. Kroll is here. Why are you here? These buildings are unlike anything I've seen before. Shocker. Okay. So this is the light chocolate one that likes us. Oops. Okay. Excellent. Yes, you can live with me. I don't care which barn, just get in a barn. Cool. So, these ones are mustard. You are also mustard. You are also mustard. Um, you are the light chocolate that we've done before. You are the strawberry. Let's attune to you. Okay. And you are dark chocolate. So I do believe that I still need to find a dark chocolate. I don't think I've discovered those yet. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's okay. Let's grab some alfalfa because we can. Let's head 
um, to the savannah. Because if we can get done with Took, that would be nice, honestly. Then we wouldn't have to travel around befriending him all the time. We do have some cheese. Okay. A horn. It's way too early for you to be in bed. Where have you gone? Okay. There's a spot by the waterfall I wanted to check out. Do you want to join me? Sure. Oh, all the way up in the forest. I brought some seeds so we could feed the birds together. It feels strange to be out here without Beast, but he'd just chase the birds away. You know how fun it is to have a pet? I miss him when I'm gone. He's even made me feel more like a part of the clan. That seems funny to say when your older sister is the leader. As kids, we were adopted by a Magrani elder. We had run away from our outcast parents. Fala was so young, she doesn't even remember them. Zeta and I do. Too well. Mm hmm. When we were little, Zeta kept us safe. As we got older, I thought it was my turn to protect us. But all I did was push people away. Maybe that's why I'm so scared now. You're such a good friend to me. I don't want to push you away, too. Aww. Did you hear that? Oh, no. Oh, he's a smart boy. In the seed, seed sack. You can't resist a bag of food, can you? There's a little bird seed left. At least he didn't eat our food this time. <laughs> and there go the birds. <laughs> okay, I think Took is very quickly becoming my favorite. Don't run off. Cold winter days just mean we get to make bigger bonfires. Yes, thanks. I don't know that we've danced yet, so we're going to dance again. Took is very quickly becoming one of my favorites. Okay. So, let's grab Knot Sage. We still need to go to the beach and talk to Croc. And we still need to go uh, to the horse totem and befriend more horses. But I think running to the beach real quick is going to be fast. And we need to do that first because humans go to bed in this game, but animals don't. So we'll take care of that. And then hopefully we'll still have time to do a bit of mining. And now that we have actually attuned to one of the chickens, we can start working on attuning to one of the horses, another one of the horses. And then we'll discover everything as well. Croc is not over here. I am dumb. Where are you? All the way out on the island. Oh, of course you are. Well, let's at least talk to Brob. It's beautiful here. But if it weren't for Enza, I wouldn't visit the mainland in winter. Do you have anything for us? Not, not really, no. Okay. Perhaps we can trade later. 
Let's dance, though. Because I haven't danced with you yet this week. And I still don't really know of anything that you actually like, which is a bit problematic. Okay. Let's come and find Croc. Who we may not be able to finish dealing with just yet, but we'll work towards that. Reese wants to show off one of my carvings. Would you go with me? Yeah. And Croc wants to date us too. Great. You made it. Reese and Ron did such a good job putting all of this together. I can't believe so many people came to see my art. What if they hate it? It's beautiful. Thank you. I worked really hard on that piece. I told Reese the story of Chala and his many carvings, and she helped me honor him by painting what I carved. It was nice working with someone else to create art. Glad you can make it, Mara. Isn't Croc so talented? What I'm saying, what am I saying? You know that. You're dating, aren't you? Oh, uh, we're, uh, sorry, I thought you were. You'd be so cute together. Let's sit. You know, Reese is right. We'd make a pretty cute cup. We'd be pretty cute together. It's been so much fun getting to know you, and I think we could create some great things together. Would you want to make it official and start dating? I just want to be friends. I like being your friend, too. I'm sure you'll inspire whoever is lucky enough to catch your eye. One more thing. What do you think of the statue? It's beautiful. I'm glad you think so, because I made it for you. Dance with me. He made the statue for us? Oh, shoot. It certainly gets a lot colder here than on the islands. Okay. So, if we look at people, Croc is getting there. We haven't danced with him today, but it doesn't seem like we're able to. Yeah, he doesn't want to dance with us. Okay. Maybe we were off-putting by not dating him? I'm not sure. Um, we gave Took a gift. We've dealt with Aloe this week, I believe. Yes. And it's nobody's birthday today, but tomorrow's the winter festival, so I guess we're off to see the horses. I mean, we could give more people gifts. We could. I'm not denying that. We definitely could do that. But for starters, I really would like to go to the horse totem. And I don't want all of our days to be spent making friends. There are a lot of other things we could be doing. So that's a spotted. That's what a spotted will grow up to look like. Okay. And this is the one that likes us. So we'll work on this one. The start. Okay. Okay. Yes, you can live with me. Oh, I'm out of space. Well, that's not great. So, you're a male. I need a female that is different. You're a male. You're a female. Okay.
Okay. And we're out of charges on the flute today. So we can't make friends with any more animals. But that's okay. We are going to have to save up some money uh, and some resources. So I'm going to say we're going to need a lot of hardwood and we're going to need a lot of stone. And we still need a little bit more tin. So let's go back to the Hardy Room and backtrack through there a little bit more. And look, there's more Jasper for Garrick. So that works. That's perfect. Come on, break the rock. Oh, it's Sardius, but that's okay. We need that too. And then we'll get some of these rocks. And hopefully we'll be able to upgrade our barns very soon. At least a little bit further. And then from there, oh, free piece of Jasper. I'll take that. That's awesome. So a little bit more mining and a little bit more fur, and we will also be able to keep expanding our farm, which is nice. But we need to work on those barns. That is incredibly important for us right now. Uh, but we'll get there. And I do want to slowly go through and work towards upgrading all of our accessories as our life gets a little bit easier, we'll need less stamina. And so we should be able to ex uh, we should be able to improve more accessories. I wanna start, however, with our primary three that we actually use. Cause I think that that needs to take priority. We'll get lots of good stuff as we go. And we're almost done upgrading all of our tools. Once we have enough tin, all we need to upgrade at the moment is going to be our hoe. And I don't know if we'll be able to go any further than just upgrading our hoe, um, but we'll have to see. We're going to have to make more food or find our missing food here soon, but that's okay. But we are really going to need to upgrade our barns here in the next few days. Um, yeah, we should keep collecting stuff. I'm not sure how much further we can backtrack here, but we're going to. We're getting there, though little bit more ore to go and we'll be good. And more silver, of course, is a bonus because we just lost a bunch of silver. 
I don't know if we're going to need a sapphire for anything else, but I guess we'll figure that part out. Um, yeah, that would be a long trek, so we are going to go back across here to get home. Because as much as we have a lot of stamina, um, waking up missing a big chunk of that is not ideal. We'll go ahead and we'll go back to our land. <laughs> and it'll be one o'clock in the morning. Uh, and we don't have a whole lot to sell. We do have a piece of horn. So that's useful. And yeah. We've got a whole bunch of stuff that actually just needs to be sorted and put away for right now. And we are going to need to get our hands on some more that's not my house. On some more that's not my house. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's a thing. We'll come on in here. We'll grab this cheese out. We'll get some sleep. We'll be up to 219,000 clan prosperity, to which we contributed a measly 129, but that's okay. Going to be back up to 7,000. And we need to get up to 12. And tomorrow, we will encounter the Winter Festival. But that is going to have to wait. For with the saving of the game and the ending of the day, we have come to the end of another episode. If you like what you see, please feel free to hit that thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more, consider subscribing. But until next time, may the wind bring you on another journey. And have a good night.